a central air data computer computes altitude, vertical speed, airspeed, a Mach number from sensor inputs such as pitot and static pressure and temperature. Early CADC systems were electromechanical computers, such as in the F111. From 1968 to 1970, the first digital CADC was developed for the F-14. In the 1980s, the standard central air data computer was developed to retrofit USAF and USN aircraft. F-14 CADC The F-14 CADC was a groundbreaking integrated flight control system developed by Garrett Air Research. It was used in early versions of the U.S. Navy's F-14 Tomcat fighter. It is notable for its early use of Air Research's custom-designed MOS-based LSI microprocessor chipset, the MP944. The CADC was designed and built at Garrett Air Research by a team led by Steve Geller and Ray Hull and supported by the startup American Microsystems. Design work started in 1968 and was completed in June 1970, beating out a number of electromechanical systems that had also been designed for the F-14. The CADC consisted of an A to D converter, several quartz pressure sensors, and the MOS-based microprocessor. Inputs to the system included the primary flight controls, a number of switches, static and dynamic air pressure and a temperature gauge. The outputs controlled the primary flight controls, wing sweep, the F-14's leading edge, glove, and the flaps. The MP944 contained six chips used to build the CADC's microprocessor, all based on a 20-bit fixed point fraction 2's complement number system. They were the parallel multiplier unit, the parallel divider unit, the random access storage, the read-only memory, the special logic function, and the steering logic unit. The complete microprocessor system used one PMU, one PDU, one SLF, three RASs, three SLUs, and 19 ROMs. In 1971, Holt wrote an article about the system for Computer Design magazine, but the Navy classified it, and finally released it in 1998. For this reason, the CADC and MP944 remain fairly obscure in spite of their historical importance.